Hey, what's the deal, YouTube? This is Chris Milan 2 with another re review coming from um, MK Hip Hop. Um, let me start off by showing you. I ordered about, I think, eight items. Um, this is a box it came in. This is a box it came in. Today is Sunday. I got it yesterday, which was Saturday. I ordered it about, let me see, maybe nine days earlier. The only reason why it took as long as it did because it actually got, um, it ran into customs. Customs held it for two days. Um, and it cleared it. And it pretty much, the minute they cleared it, it shipped like the next day. So, um, let's start with the, let's start the review. Um, first, let's start with the pair. I got a pair of Ray Bans. This pair of Ray Bans. These are the Ray Bans right here. Red frame. For those days at the beach, get a closer look. Mm. Ray Band, and it's engraved right there with an RB. Same thing with the right side. RB engraved. So this is the frame. I don't know you can see it has ray band on the lens as well. And this is the inside of the glasses. They cool, but um on the glasses, like on this side, under the paint there's black marks that's under the paint. And it's like mm, I'm not too happy about that at all with the glasses. Um this is a box they came in. Ray band. This is a glass, sunglass case they came in. These are like the pamphlets or whatever. I have one for that. Um, what's next? I've got a pair of uh, um, Jordan Spizzox from my little boy. These are a size 2.5 wide, they call they call them. Um, they're cool. I mean, on a bubble. The bubble was cloudy, like a shoe polish is all on it. Paint, whatever they use when they paint it, the bottom of the shoes. Um, this one, it's the elephant print. On this one, is um, it, it it's smeared on the front. Can't see it on here, of course. Too bright, but it's smeared. But overall, I mean, they're cool. They're kids' shoes, so, I mean, kids really not tripping like that. Um... I got for me a pair of LeBron cannons. These are uh, the cannons. They're they cool. They dope. I like them. In person, they they they're tight in person. Only thing about these is that the back, these right here. This one is centered. This one isn't centered. This one is more to this side of the shoe. It's not centered. This one is centered. The tab. This one is not centered. So that's the only qualm I have about these shoes. Is that one thing? Uh, let's see what's next. Oh, this is a a Baltimore Bullets snapback. And as you guys can see, how I bent up a look. That's exactly how it came in the box. I have not sat on this hat or had anybody else sit on it or nothing. This is how it came. Messed up. Not happy about that. And it's very. I don't know if you can hear that. It's hard. Let me show you guys the other. This is Mitchell and Ness snapback. Let me show you a real Mitchell and Ness snapback. Hold on. Uh, this is Mitchell and Ness snapback. This is a real one. And it doesn't. It's very. It's like the material is soft compared to this one. This stuff is like. It's been starched or something. It's stiff as all know what. Very stiff. Um, inside of the hat, I mean, has whatever. It's like the other, like the real ones. But it's very stiff. Don't like that too much at all. Um. Also, I got a hoodie. I'm not sorry, not a hoodie, but I got my son. Um, this is an extra extra large for kids. It's a polo collar shirt. There's a horse. Horse. I mean, as far as this one, I like this. This is nice. 
His stuff came on nice. Mine's garbage. Garbage. Number three on the sleeve. And on the back it has P.O. And L.O. On the front. Polo. Alright. I also bought him a polo hoodie. Pleasant. I'm, I'm fine with this too. See that, people? This is the inside of the tag, and it's very thin. And serious, man, it feels warm. Too warm for Cali right now. For LA, too warm. But when them not cold nights don't come, they definitely like. Definitely is gonna look like it will definitely feel good. This one has a number five on the right sleeve and on the bottom back of it. Like above the butt are the there's three horsemen, you know, and it's actually I ordered it says a girl hoodie, and that probably may explain why they have pink. There's pink in there, so sorry son. My apologies. Um, I ordered a hoodie for me, and huh, garbage. The red feels fine. The red feels like it's part of the hoodie. This blue, I'm pretty sure y'all can even see the red linen there. But it's like, it's as, it's as if the blue is painted on. It's like, if y'all can hear that, compared to, it's like it's blue for like denim or something. It's painted on here, man. Um, And by the way, this is I got the hoodie. I got all this stuff yesterday, and the zipper broke on me yesterday. So, I mean, can't get mad. It's replica, whatever. So, you live and you learn. Um, but that's the the horse. The horse. It, it's, it looks. I mean, besides the zipper being broke and the discoloration, the I mean, which is damn near everything. This is the um the tag and the inside is supposed it's like netted. It's like a net on the inside of the hoodie. It's netted. Um I also had a bolt. I might even I don't even have a polo t shirt on me. So displeased with that didn't even want to show it. It's an extra I ordered an extra extra large and it feel like a large. So these are the bags, some of the polos. I don't know which polos came in, which bags, whatever. These are the, this is the bag my son's shoes came in. It's like a fruit bag from the grocery store, man. You put your pears in or something. What the heck? And at least let me hold. Let me show y'all. Let me try this, this hoodie on so you can see. So y'all can see how freaking small it fits. And this is an extra, extra large. 2XL. Let me see. And... It feels like a large, maybe because I need to lose some weight, my big ass. But who knows? It still fits. It don't feel like no 2XL. Not at all. This thing is very um boy band tight, tight. You know what I'm saying? Hop on stage, this thing. About three more dudes and sing a duet. It's pretty boy tight, and I don't like that. Uh uh. So um. Like I said, you know, they were, MK Hip Hop is also busy, man. People keep on saying, you know, Hip Hop IOP is busy. I ordered from both of them around the same time. Um, I think a day apart. And they're both busy. They're both, because it's taking, I mean, it takes forever to get a response from either either site. So I'm going to be surprised if they own, if they're the same people with different names. Um, but... It took it. Yeah, they're very, very busy. So if anybody ordering, just be very, um, just be patient. That's all I can say. Be patient. I don't think they're out to get you for your money at all. But they're backed up and a bit off more than what they can chew. So um, if you place the order, be patient. If you haven't placed the order, I don't know. I suggest just um, hell, check out some other sites. I know I did it. I'm gonna do a um a order from BizKey21 to see what they stuff look like. I also have stuff coming in, like I said, from H um, Hip Hop ILP. So um yeah.
YouTube. Thanks for everything. Comments. Whatever you got. Get at me. Later.